In this demonstration, you'll see how quickly and easily you can use Customer Care API on MinSat to handle Compass DA in Charging System 5. I have selected a couple of DAs previously created to help us on this exercise. So first, I'll tie a regular DA to the subscriber, check the logs on STP, and verify if the DA was added accordingly. You can add a regular DA in the same way as it is done on previously charging system versions. On the logs, it is possible to see the amount of money applied in this transaction. On the view account menu, let's check if the dedicated account is already present. Now to the same subscriber, I'll tie a composite DA with multiple sub-DAs, take into consideration different dates in order to avoid cropping. As you can see on the new logs, I have the information that a composite DA was added. To add sub-dedicated accounts, you just check the box of the dedicated account and go to the tab sub-dedicated accounts and add as many as you wish. On the view account menu in STP, the Composite DA, which is already active, can be viewed here with the Composite DA checkbox marked. Using the Document Programs Guide Customer Care API, included on the MinSight library, it is possible to find the whole API command description. Let's take a look on the item, Delete Dedicate Account for the Subscriber as an example. Here is the command line to be used during this procedure. And if you want to have a look on the, how the XML looks like, you can check it on this link. In our case, we prepared a per script to run this task for us. Here I'm passing as parameters the subscriber number and the dedicated account ID, which I want to delete. Now I'm going to execute the script. And as response, we get a dedicated account delete result blob with information about the dedicated account that was deleted. As you can see here, the dedicated account no longer exists. Thank you for watching us. See you in the next session.